thank you all for coming. This mural, uh, we had a lot of help with. Uh, this particular building has been here for a long time. It's right in between our community center, uh, the Cephas House, and Eddie Durham Park. And the building itself, when you looked at it before the mural, what I always noticed was the sewer lines going on the side of it. Uh, but they've done a wonderful job in, uh, in disguising all of that and really creating something that has a great impact. And uh, there's a lot of people to thank for this particular mural. And I want to make sure that Amberly, uh, Amberly Russell from KTSW, and she works uh, for the radio station and for the university. This was, uh, really, it was their vision. They approached the Mural Arts Committee and asked if they could produce this uh, mural on this building. So they went through the normal application process. Uh, we had a few design changes along the way, and uh, came up with something that everybody could agree on and live with, and really the finished product has turned out great. I will also let you know that this was the least expensive mural that we've done today. It was very quick, it was very inexpensive. Uh, the artist was Cody Sigman, and I believe Cody lives at Texas State, right? or, or currently enrolled at Texas State. So this is, I think, the third or fourth mural that we've done or in the process of doing uh, that is uh, being done by Texas State artists. So we're, we're really thrilled to have such great local talent. And last night really proved that uh, our community is truly, truly committed to artists and the arts. And one thing that we notice about when we do these mural programs is that their talent truly amazes us and they do things that we cannot do. Uh, I can't draw a stick paper, but somebody can, can produce a, a, a beautiful mural without really working hard. And the artists that that we have that the mural from San Marcos Mural Arts Program is are sponsoring are really expanding our minds. And the public art that they're producing is making us a better community. Uh, they're teaching us that to be different, and to think differently, and to do different things is good. And especially this week, I think we can all agree that that, that kind of thing that happens in our community promotes tolerance. That's what our community, and that's what the arts helps bring to Santa Barbara. It's a different way of thinking, and a, a positive to being unique. And tolerance is so important for, for our community. Uh, Cody is the artist. Did you want to say uh, Oh, yeah. I just wanted to thank the city of San Marcos and Amberly Russell. And uh, I was really happy to have that opportunity. And I hope that everyone enjoys what we've done here and hopefully uh, there'll be some other future, future things that happen that try to promote arts in uh, the city of San Marcos. So thank you. Thank you. Cody. Now I'm going to bring up Amberly Russell. Come on up, Amberly. And Amberly uh, really is the driving force behind this project. She uh, participated in our uh, program with Philadelphia Mural Arts Program. She learned how to how to apply <laughs> the process that they do, and then shortly thereafter made the application to produce this mural. So we're very proud of you. We thank you very much, very much for what you've done. And I'd like to say Well, I wasn't prepared to speak, uh, <laughs> but. I just wanted to say, as the Community Relations Director for KTSW-FM 89.9, uh, the official radio station for
for Texas State University. Um, I just wanted to say how important uh, community is to our radio station and want to thank um, Amy and Lisa for everything that they've done throughout the process to support us and guide us and get this ball rolling. We love you guys. We love the city of San Marcos. Thank you to Cody Sigmund. And this is my team right here. KPSW represents. They are part of the community relations department also. So we're just so happy to be here. And thank you so much for having us. So thank you, Andrew. Uh, again, a wonderful collaboration. Thank you.